No one has more than 2,000 assists in the WNBA, except Penichero. That is vintage Penichero. My best moment ever in the WNBA and I think in my career was winning the 2005 WNBA championship. I think that's what everybody plays for, especially in um, team sports. It's a team goal every year to make the playoffs and then win a championship. And we had been trying for so long, um, but playing in the West against the Houston Comets, the Sparks, the Storm, the Lynx, the Mercury was really, really tough. But in 2005, we finally got to, to win the championship in front of our fans in the sellout crowd, 17,000 people in Sacramento. So it was, I would say, definitely uh, the best moment of my career ever. I mean, I have a lot of individual awards, but to me, it's always about the team and um, and winning in the most competitive and the best league in the world was um, definitely the cherry on, on top of the cake. I guess I consider myself an old school point guard. If you look at the point guards now, not just in the women's game, but also in the men's game and even college, um, you see most of the point guards are scorers and they really uh, look into score. I definitely was more of a set up um, my teammates type of player and just try to set the table so they can eat. <laughs> and I enjoy doing that. Uh, I enjoy passing the ball. It's, I think, one of my biggest and best attributes was my court vision and, and the way that I was able to set up my teammates. Um, so yeah, I definitely enjoy doing that. The thought is actually now is almost like a sad one because the Monarchs folded in 2009 and nobody really saw it happening. And I thought that we were so competitive and we, we had amazing fans. We, we packed the house. We had some of the best fans in the, in the league. And then in 2006, we actually went back to the finals. So we were very successful and to uh, fold like that without any warning and just kind of being blindsided was, it was tough. And even now I feel like there's so many uh, fans still from the Monarchs in the Bay Area that would love to get a team back. I remember like it was yesterday, the confetti coming from the ceiling. Um, I know my parents and my family was up at five o'clock in the morning watching the game live in Portugal. So it was just an indescribable feeling um, and definitely what we all play for uh, to win championships.